We are just seven weeks away from the start of the Rio Olympics. One Minnesota athlete is about to become a worldwide star. Maggie Nichols is from Little Canada. The graduate of Roosevelt High School is practically a shoe-in to be picked for Team USA next month at the Olympic trials. Dave McCoy caught up with her as she gets ready for Rio. Before you even get in the door at Twin City Twisters in Champlin, it's clear whose gym this is. And how much pride it has in its hometown star. The kids around her, you saw when they just look at her and amazement to have someone with so much talent to be in the gym nearby is such an inspiration for so many kids. Maggie Nichols has been training here for the last 12 years. And lately, that training has been ramped up big time as the Olympics draw near. You know, the intensity level right now is just, you know, so high. We have so many expectations for ourselves and so many goals and dreams that we want to achieve. Since the Olympics is just so close, you know, it crosses my, our minds all the time. And in the gym, we're just, you know, every turn, we kind of think about it like, what if this is my Olympic team? Like, I need to make it perfect. Because she has an equally intense amount of pride in representing the United States, and even more so in representing Minnesota. I want people to know that I'm from Minnesota, and it's just cool to represent Minnesota, but also the U.S. It's just a huge honor. And there's definitely just that Minnesota pride. You know, one of ours has made it. That's the thing about Nichols' road to Rio. She's not just from Minnesota. She wasn't just born here and then moved away to chase her dreams when her career really started taking off. She stayed here in school at Roseville High School, in training here at this same gym. She is, and her talent is, truly a product of Minnesota. A lot of gymnasts um, that feel like they're gonna go into the elite level sometimes move to gyms that have trained other Olympic gymnasts, but um, I felt growing up that my coaches here at Twin State Twisters could really help me get to that point, and I knew that they knew all the knowledge of gymnastics, and I really trusted them, and they really motivated me to be the best that I could, and I knew that I could go very far with them. You've raised something in your state that can be successful, and it's not like somebody came from another state and, and then we took off from there. It's all from, we started in Roseville and then came over here, so it's, it's huge. Having someone who's doing what she's doing is is creating a culture here and in the state making kids believe because when you're a little kid you know and they start the sport of gymnastics it's like i want to be an olympian and everybody thinks that but now we have an example like it can actually happen right here and so i think that's pretty awesome nichols couldn't agree more and can't wait to experience the moment she arrives in Rio. I mean, words probably can't even describe that feeling. It's such an honor that, you know, all my hard work throughout my whole career is, is paying off, and I'll just be so honored to represent the U.S. and Minnesota, and I just want to do my best and help Team USA. That looks hmm. really hard. So strong. <laughs> oh, my man. goodness gracious, that's impressive. That is conditioning. Wow. The next big thing coming out of Minnesota. Good, yeah. you, good luck to you, Maggie, at the Olympics this summer.